What do you, what has surprised you the most about the realities of the business? I'll start with you on that one, Izzy. The thing that surprises me the most is, um, I mean, there's a lot of things. Like, I was not expecting people to kind of lack initiative. There's a lot. Who? I guess I'm generalizing here. It feels like everyone just kind of doesn't, or like A&R scouts who think that they have credit in making a record because they've put people in a room together. I'm like, the songwriters wrote that song, not you. Or like this kind of weird sort of lingering 90s arrogance that still lives in the undercurrents of the whole of the music industry. Um, And I'm also uh, surprised by how shocked people are that we managed to do what we do with not a major label and without a huge marketing budget and without a creative director and without all of these things. I mean, there's there's so many great people that work in the music industry, but I still always get surprised when you meet, and there's quite a lot of them, people, whether it's in labels or management or PR or something, that really don't care about music. Or yeah. they don't care about the... It's just... It's a job that... Makes them feel cool to do. Yeah, exactly. And that's not changed. Like that, yeah. we were saying yeah. before, like that's one of the reasons I left working at the labels. I'm yeah. like, I care so much about this band, this music, what this cu- culturally, what this means. Mm. I don't understand how people can be in the business and, mm. and not have that responsibility. Mm. There's, there's plenty of people that are the opposite, but I just can't imagine why you choose to work in such an industry and if you just didn't care about it. As it goes back to what you were saying, though, it's like they're trying to kind of glom on some coolness. <clears throat> like, like it's like a vampire to you as the artist. Like, they're getting their credibility from you. You know mm. what I mean? I think that's, that like, by association. I always used to say, ooh, yeah. you have a backstage pass. Ooh, that makes you so cool. And it's like, yeah. no, like the coolest people are ones that don't care about the backstage pass. Yeah. They just yeah. want to get shit done. They want to go and watch the show. Yeah, like, yeah. It's like the VIP bar festivals always oh. does my head in because it's just full of twats. Yeah, yeah. <laughs>